Well, temperatures are getting really hot out there. We are already into the 90s here in Spokane as we take a live look from our sky cam over downtown Spokane. Temperatures into the lower 90s right now, and we are only going to be picking up a few degrees as we head into the next couple of days. Things are about to get dangerously hot across the region. Tonight, not going to cool down a whole lot either. It's going to be 64 degrees for our overnight low. Clear skies, our winds are going to be light this evening. And then as we head into the day tomorrow, winds are going to be light also, and it is going to be very hot. 95 degrees for our high here in Spokane. We can also expect sunny skies for most of the region. Into the evening, we could see a couple of clouds moving in, but for the most part, the day going to be a hot and sunny one. Our satellite radar showing not a whole lot of activity, though, as I was saying, we're seeing a few clouds moving into southeastern Washington. We could see a few more clouds moving kind of into central Washington, but for the most part, the Spokane area and much of eastern Washington going to be staying very clear and those temperatures just picking up. High pressure is dominating over uh, eastern Washington, but we do have low pressure that is just sitting on the Washington Oregon border. That's what's bringing those few clouds into southeastern Washington and could be bringing those clouds into central Washington as well but it is not going to be bringing any precipitation. That high pressure dominating over eastern Washington, that's what's keeping our temperatures incredibly warm. We do have a heat advisory that goes into effect at 2 p.m. tomorrow and runs until 8 p.m. Tuesday for this area shaded in orange just east of the Cascades. We're seeing temperatures near 100 degrees or into the lower hundreds. Overnight lows could be into the 70s, so we need to be cautious of heat exhaustion and heat stroke. Know the signs of those, and please remember to drink plenty of water. We do have a three on our impact scale for Monday and Tuesday with those very hot temperatures. Remember to watch for heat related illnesses. Drink plenty of water. Limit your outdoor activity if you can do it in the morning or late in the evening when the temperatures are a little bit cooler. Today we reached a high of 91, a low of 55 above average temperatures, and we will continue to be that way. We're at 91 with a few clouds in the Spokane area, 90 degrees and sunny in Coeur d'Alene. Our lows this evening into the 60s with a few 50s out there, 63 in the Valley, 60 in Coeur d'Alene, 58 in Moses Lake, 56 in Deer Park and Colville, and then 64 degrees in Omac. Our highs tomorrow into the upper 90s, a few mid-90s out there, and then some hundreds. You see 100 in Omac, 101 in Wenatchee in Moses Lake, 101 in Tri-Cities, 100 degrees in Lewiston, 97 in the Valley, 93 degrees in Coeur d'Alene, Seattle, 86, a very very hot day. We stay through at 95 degrees through Tuesday. Then a dry cold front cools us down slightly as we head into the weekend. We are back into the mid 80s, which will feel much more comfortable than those very hot temperatures we have coming up. Now we'll send it over to Alyssa.